Thank you. I supported the final agreement on the Fuel Quality Directive and Renewable Energy Directive, but it's far from ideal. Still, it represents progress. In this agreement, I believe we are addressing the negative side effects of the EU's support policies for biofuels, and we are also trying to ensure that publicly subsidised biofuels achieve real greenhouse gas savings. And also, I believe we are promoting the development of advanced biofuels. While the European Parliament did not achieve many of its key objectives, nonetheless the compromise will ensure a cap on first generation biofuels of 7% with member states having the possibility to set lower limits. ILOC factors will be reported by fuel suppliers and by the Commission and in its review the Commission will consider including ILOC emission factors in the maximum emission levels for biofuels in the future. Furthermore, energy crops will in principle be included in the 7% cap. This proposal, as I said, is not as ambitious as we would have liked, but it is an improvement.